In this video, we're going to talk about magnetic fields. Now, of course, a magnetic field is a region of space where certain things can experience some kind of a magnetic force. And so the things that typically experience this magnetic force could be things like geomagnetic poles, north poles and south poles. We'll also see we can have current carrying conductors and also we can have moving charges. And any one of these things that you place within this region could experience something called a magnetic force. And so like the other fields that we have learned before, like gravitational fields and uh, electric fields, a lot of the rules that we have learned still apply. And stuff like those include the density of the lines in being indicative of the field strength, right? And so a quick look at this diagram tells you that the field strength is pretty strong over here as may be compared to over there, simply because of how close the lines are. And of course, we have also learned that these field lines cannot cross. And of course, when you look at this diagram over here, for typical uh, magnetic field around the bar magnet, you do not see any crossing of the lines. Now, something unique, of course, to magnetic fields is that uh, your magnetic fields always move from the North Pole to the South Pole, as you can see, as indicated by these arrows, all right? And, uh, but what you should also uh, pay attention to is that if you are going inside the magnet itself, what actually happens is that the field lines join up like so. I'm going to try to draw this as nicely as I can. Okay, maybe just for the top and bottom few lines because the, the lines in the middle are too concentrated for me. But if you're inside the magnet, the field lines actually go from south to north. And so that's something interesting to take note of. Now, if we look at our Earth, just a nice little fun fact. The North Pole is here. The South Pole is here. The Earth has its own magnetic field. And we know that if I'm standing here and I place a compass here, it should point to the North Pole. And so the Earth's magnetic field actually goes go something like that and it should be pointing in this direction and so if i model the earth as a gigantic bar magnet the bar magnet is actually inversely placed so that the north pole ironically points to the south and the south pole points to the north and that is actually why your magnetic fields are as such so just a nice little fun fact to take note of 